Well, greetings, friends. A beautiful day here in eastern North Carolina. Well, our reading today is in 1 Kings chapters 21 to 23, and we read about the son, the grandson, and the great-grandson of Hezekiah. Well, I'm going to focus our attention on the great-grandson of Hezekiah. His name was Josiah. And when Josiah was a, a good king, like uh, Hezekiah, but uh, he was uh, repairing the temple. And when they were repairing the temple, they found a book. And it was the book of the law. It was the law of Moses. We would know it as the first five books of the Bible today. But he found the book, and the scripture says in verse number 8, that, and that they found the book in verse number 11, when the king heard the words of the book, he tore his clothes. He knew they were in trouble. In verse 13, he says... Um, We've not obeyed the law, and and we are going to be destroyed. So uh, in verse number 19, however, he was encouraged uh, by the prophetess that said, because you have repented, because you have uh, confessed, and you knew, see how you have disobeyed the book, the judgments that are found in that book are not coming in your days. Now, what do we see in this? I see that we need to find the book. We need to find the book. You see, the book that we have is the Word of God, the whole Word of God, the Old Testament and the New Testament. And there's so many people that may have the book in their home, sitting on a shelf, but we need to find the book and take it off the shelf and read the book. One time I was in, when I was in uh, Lithuania many years ago, I was talking to someone about the Word of God and, and they said, oh, we have the Word of God. It's been sitting on my shelf. I haven't read it in years. Friends, I want to say that that it does no good if it just sits on our shelf. We need to find the book. And when we read the book and find out that there are things that we haven't been living up to according to the plans of God, then we need to repent. And I can tell you, if we repent, uh, uh, judgment won't come upon our life. If we repent, he will forgive us of our sins and cleanse us from all unrighteousness. So I encourage you today, find the book, just like Josiah did. Repent of your sins, and it will go well with you. Well, God bless you. Have a wonderful day. We'll see you again tomorrow. Bye-bye.